how to save or convert files as SVG in GIMP. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can export or save or convert any type of image that you have to the SVG format. And with SVG it means S for scalable, V for vector and G for graphics. It is very easy and simple to do. All you have to do is to go ahead to the file or the images that you have. For example, I'm going to see the images. Uh, let's say here, I'm going to see the images right here. We have here the file that I want to add. For example, let's go ahead and open this image. And here we have the file. Simply, when you want to put this as a SVG, you have to add a path to it. And to add this path, you are going simply to this section. And then now if you don't see the path, all you have to do is, is to extend this sidebar right here and it will appear right here. Click on path. Here we are going to create a path for the image. If you have something like that you uh, want to make some path for it, it is very easy. All you have to do is to go ahead right here onto the tools and we see here the path. You are going to put the uh, some path for, for example, to this image and then it will appear under the paths like that. And here we have it. This is the path. Then when you have the path, it is very easy. You are going to uh, simply click on export path here and, and it will be exporting the file as an SVG. We are going simply to uh, export path to SVG. Here we are going to put, for example, image path like that. And we are going to download it as SVG. And here we have it. For example, select a folder. I'm going to select this. And here we have it. We have the file selected as SVG. That was only the first step. Now we are going or you are going to put the path and select only the path that you need from, for example, this example and image and for example, like that, we are going to select this right path and here we have it. Also with this one, make it a little curved and then we are going to make something like that. And this is the paths. So we are going to uh, export these paths as SVG and then we are going to proceed them with another software such as Photoshop or something like that. It is a very easy and very simple. Now that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope to see you soon on the next one.